Hello everyone, this is Joey. I'm back for uh, another short video. I wanted to talk about my teeth. Uh, you probably can't see it. Uh, no, you can't see it, but over here there is a tooth on the bottom that they had to put a crown on because uh, I kind of went for a period where I didn't go to the dentist for a while and I previously had a filling in that that tooth and it was a fairly large filling and so it got another cavity underneath the filling so they had to drill out the filling and then basically once they did that there wasn't a whole lot of the tooth left and they had to put a crown on it so last night while eating skittles for no reason um, the tooth came out and this has been a problem with this tooth ever since I got this crown it perpetually pops out it just keeps popping out anytime I and I make a conscious effort when I chew to chew on this side of my mouth especially if it's something gummy or sticky or anything like that which is fairly annoying uh, uh, but I, I do want to try to keep it in there and I've probably had it replaced about four times maybe but anyway it popped back out last night so um, basically what happened is that the dentist what my current dentist is telling me is that the dentist that put this one in uh, did not leave enough tooth uh, there for it to properly anchor so uh, and just like glued it in there so uh, uh, I knew it was gonna be trouble because when I originally went and got it like the they gave you they give you like a uh, they they did all the work and then they they give me like a, a temporary crown and the crown the temporary crown fell out the day they put it in and so I went back and had him put it in, put it back in, and then like the next day it fell out again. So I just left it out until basically I could uh, go up there and, and get um, get the real one put in, which they kind of scolded me about because they said that your teeth like will kind of fill that gap, you know. <laughs> but it wouldn't stay in, and they didn't want to put any more heart, any more. Um, stronger glue on it for fear that they wouldn't be able to get it off so I just left it off so anyway um, then that one came off uh, once uh, or it's came off like three times I think so this would be the fourth time it's come off the last time I was gonna have it redone my dentist said that because um, the whole reason I haven't had it he said that he could fix it but that my insurance will not pay for it so I'd have to pay full price for it and it would be really expensive so uh, the last time he was gonna kinda like score my t tooth and try to uh, give the the crown something to grip but it's so that tooth is so sensitive the nerves are just right underneath uh, the what's left of the tooth that uh, he just couldn't do that so um, Hope, I'm hoping, I can't remember if it's three years or five years. If it's five years, I've still got a, a little bit of time to wait. But if it's three years, I should be able to get partial insurance coverage of this. So I'm going to uh, give them a call at some point. Probably not today, but tomorrow maybe. Because now, the, it used to really bother me, and now it doesn't bother me nearly so much. Uh, like if the crown was off, I couldn't even put stuff in my mouth. It was so sensitive. But now it's, I guess I'm so used to it now that it's its deadened to a certain extent. Anyway, uh, so I'm going to go up there and see what they can do. If they could redo it to where it will not be coming off all the time. And uh, not all the time, but at least once every, you know, every six months to a year, it'll, it'll pop off. <sighs> so... Anyway, um, that's it. That's the story of my tooth, and I'm going to try to get it fixed. And that's the end of this video. Peace out. See you next time. Bye.